went to do my local HMV the other day and had a really nice, uh, pleasant surprise. Uh, I was just looking at the new releases and I noticed American Ninja 1 on Blu-ray and then like right, right next to it, parts 2, 3 and 4. I was like, wow, all the American Ninja films will come on Blu-ray. So it was kind of like, I was like, oh, which one should I get? And I had enough money for about two of them. And I was thinking about getting American Ninja, A, because it's the first one, and it's got a uh, like feature length documentary that's got Basically, everybody involved with the first American Ninja film, like the director Sam Furstenberg, Michael Dudikoff's on there. I was like, oh, I'll have to get that. And then I've always got a soft spot for American Ninja 3, which was one of the very first ninja movies I ever saw. You should have a poster for it up on my bedroom. And, uh, and, so, and there's a great trailer out there by, narrated by Peter Cullen, the voice of Optimus Prime. And I thought, oh, I'll, I'll, have to, I'll have to get that as well. And so I just had a quick walk around the shop. And as I was walking around the shop, I noticed this. It's um, it was, they're all by 18 films, and this is American Ninjas 1 to 4, uh, uh, like a sort of com complete collection sort of thing. And um, it's got really, you know, like I say, it's all the, it's got like a shuriken on there, some non shucks and stuff. But it's got all the um, the first four movies on there, and uh, it's got the you know, feature length documentary that's off the first disc. And they did really great transfers of the, um, of the films as well, and they're like, they do really. Uh, one thing I always think is a good sign of a good transfer is if they don't just get rid of all the film grain and you know sort of make it really digital and soulless. Like really super clear transfers, but at the same time you could tell like you know they were done from you know taken from the original negatives and stuff and and that kind of stuff is really cool. One thing it's always conspicuous by its absence. I'm not sure why um, American Ninja Five is not in the collection, but I sometimes like having an extra one to find it's like a it's like an archaeologist or um, Indiana Jones you've got to try and track it down but uh, yeah so uh, thanks 88 films for releasing this and go buy to American Ninja the complete collection uh, I mean not the complete collection the ultimate collection it's not complete because part there's no part five why no part five <laughs> Pat Morita's in it too <laughs>